Here at Storefront Science, we have a variety of offerings. Children and their families come and can explore in any of our spaces. We have a, a biology corner, we have marble racers where kids can learn the laws of physics, we have a building area where they can learn engineering. Um, I always have electric circuits out, today I've added magnets, so there's always something happening and people can come in and just play. Very fun and you get to like experiment a lot of different things like I really like the electricity. I like it because um because um I usually don't know how to do a lot of things here. So I tried the electricity um and I wanted to see how to use it. You have to and clean then, up and then I You're tried right. and then I tried it. I did the best. And then I um found out how to do it and it was very easy. The thing that surprises me most about the curiosity of children is that it's always there. I think it was really fun. I meant, like, I learned a lot of things I never knew. And I think, like, Chris in a Jar is pretty interesting and, like, the fish. I mean, I remember my, I had this moment when my friend's daughter was, like, two. When we were sitting, even before my daughter, we were sitting in a restaurant and there Greta sat opening different sugar packets, like sugar equals Splenda, and kind of, you know, playing with them and then putting a little water on them and seeing what happens. There's a two-year-old who totally understands what curiosity can take you. Like she was doing research-based science at two and yet we don't give kids enough opportunity to take that natural curiosity and do stuff with it. I come here for a Lego robotics group. It's really fun because you get to try all these things like the marble racer or you get to look at the critters and you can read books. And I just tried the electricity thing today. The reason for, for this place was to, to take curiosity and say, ah, go see what happens if you're curious about that. Well, I learned how to make a parallel circuit because I've never done that before. First, I did the marble racers, and then I did the electricity. First, I was kind of having trouble um, doing the marble racers because it wouldn't go into the pot, but eventually I got it in. In, in the front of the shop, we have this table filled with um, biological spe specimens, and all day I'll sit here and I'll see people just glued to the window, curious about like kind of these gross things in a jar. Once I walked in here, was, I, I didn't expect it and it was very cool and scientific and interesting. And you get to try new stuff and then you learn new stuff you never did. Learn before like, like um, the animals here. There you go. You can see how they, what they do and how they look. And you can see them up close with the microscope or magnifying glass. I, I want to see Storefront Science become a national franchise, I'll be completely honest, but I love the idea that everything is getting piloted right here in my hometown, in essence, and with my daughter's friends and, and my community members and neighbors. I, I like that this is a community-based effort that um, will be born here, but then hopefully go somewhere else, and that we'll always have Washington Heights as our starting point. Yeah.